Welcome back to Tucson, and we are on site. Gonna do a lithium upgrade to this Four Winds Class C. So here we are on uh, Class C. We are up in Oral Valley, north side of Tucson. On site, we're gonna swap out these old lead acid batteries and put in a couple of lithium 100 amp hour batteries. Also gonna do a couple of other things. The existing converter won't charge up to lithium's high, higher voltage, so we're gonna replace it with this Victron smart charger. And then also gonna swap out the existing uh, solenoid and put in a DC to DC charger so pretty simple really overall these are coming out we're going to bring them out first so that we can work without having to worry about any sparks the WIFCO converter is in the bottom there um, this IP65 smart charger will actually fit right in the bottom of that so we'll, we'll basically remove and replace that'll take care of the charging when she's plugged into shore power and then under the hood is where the solenoid is. So depending on how much space we have uh, under the step, we may be able to just put the DC to DC charger there and then tie it together up here. If not, we're gonna pull that solenoid out and put the DC to DC charger in there. So we'll see how this turns out. All right, we got the old converter out and you can see we got a hot line, neutral line, ground line that's going into the box here. And then we got our positive and negative, which is where it takes the 120 volt and creates the 12 volt to charge the batteries through this system. So all this is gonna come out and we're gonna replace it with these two cables. And then this one is coming out of the uh, Victron charger. This one is just a, a pigtail so that we can plug the charger in. If we were replacing a deck mount converter, it would already have a plug in, wouldn't need this. Part. So we'll get this out, get the new one in, see what it looks like. Okay, we got the old one out. Here's what the new one looks like. Fits in there nice and snug. You've got a couple of screws up front, so it's never gonna move. And you can see we got our neutral ground and line plugged in. And then here's our new negative, new positive running behind there. So 25 amps at full lithium capability. All right, we'll close this up and move to the next step. Okay, you've already seen the new charger underneath. And you see now our DC to DC charger against the wall. And it's IP65 rated, so not worried about water or dust. We got our two rich solar 100 amp hour, uh, these, this is the Alpha One Pro model, so it's Bluetooth and they are heated. Uh, so being exposed down there is okay. And got them in parallel and everything's zip tied in and secured, so they're not gonna move. So and we've already tested both the charger, putting out 25 amps and the DC to DC charger, putting out 50 amps. Uh, so now she is fully converted over to lithium and ready to hit the road. <laughs> 